Last time out in Undisputed, we took down that man, Cody Rhodes, with a little bit of help from Roman Reigns, and we are now Universal Undisputed Champion of the WWE. Let's see what Cody has to say about it. Cody, man, I was going to give you a call, but figured we should talk in person. I don't blame you. I know you and Reigns weren't in on it together. He was trying to hurt me not help you I appreciate that at the same time we both know I had you beat when Reigns attacked me from behind is that what we know one two three four five and that's when I got up to check on the ref I don't need to recap I was there and I have the championship to prove it you took the crossroads it was over Look, you hung tough. Your time will come, but last night, you were done. Maybe so, but that was last night. Tonight's a different story. How so? We'd never fought before. Tonight, I know you. That works both ways. No, I mean, I know you. That little panicked freeze you get every time you're under pressure. That worry you're not measuring up to your legacy. That you'll never finish the story. Man, you're not fighting me. You're fighting you. Wow, turns out it's going to feel pretty good making you a one-night champion with an asterisk by his name. Can you win a title somebody doesn't hand you, Cody? See you out there. Well, looks like we're in a bit of trouble. <laughs> Talking smack to Cody might get us in a little bit of bother there. Let's see what Regal has to say about it all. It is an absolute crime the position that Roman Reigns has put you in. The cloud now hanging over your reign as WWE Universal Champion belies your efforts. I know you fought like hell to win the title. You're damn right I did. I had to compete in an extra match too. And I still made it to the finals. And won. A fine achievement that the WWE Universe nonetheless looks askance at. Unfortunately, Reigns beat Cody as much as you did. Perhaps more. People think Cody would have won? Great. Tonight, we face each other again, one on one. I am ready to prove to you and the WWE Universe that I deserve to carry the title. Good lad. You can't let the world define you. You have to define yourself. And now, I'm going to define myself as the undisputed WWE Universal Champion. Love to hear it. Now, if you'll excuse me, it's a very busy night with the draft starting. Good luck. There you go, folks. Regal has spoken to us. And it's all done and dusted. Let's go fight Cody. It's the brand new, undisputed, WWE Universal Champion. And here we come, ladies and gentlemen, with that belt wrapped tightly around our waist. Ready to defend it for the first time as Universal Champion. Can we live up to the previous reign of Roman Reigns? Or will we just be a one-night sensation? Let's Do we find have out. To call this guy undisputed. After Roman Reigns handed him the title at SummerSlam, he's very much disputed. The finals were full of controversy, but the champion did win the tournament and has another opportunity to prove himself tonight. With Roman Reigns back in Hollywood, we can finally settle the WWE Universal Championship controversy once and for all. That's right, by getting the title to the right guy. If this is anything like the tournament finals, Cody Rhodes is going to make quick work of the so-called champion. I'll admit that the champion Cody is the underdog in off to a confident start, doing push-ups. Rhodes and the dark horse jockeying for position here. Stop! Stop the damn match! What is Miz doing out here? <laughs> this guy. This unsanctioned match. That's right, unsanctioned. I'm so sorry to ruin his lordship's plan, but Raw's royal general manager, William Regal, seems to have forgotten something. What is Miz talking about? Unsanctioned? 
Regal forgot that I had the first pick in the draft. So this conspiracy to steal the undisputed WWE Universal Championship for Raw ends tonight. He's not going to do this in the middle of his huge match, is he? The WWE Universal Champion has been drafted to SmackDown. Effective immediately. Miz oh, can't fantastic. do this. He just did, Saxton, and it's brilliant. Come on. Get out of the ring and grab your <laughs> It's time to go to your new home. Cheer up, Rhodes. I'm sure Regal will give you another chance at the World Heavyweight Championship. Regal doesn't look happy. Speak of the devil. Have a look, Regal. All the I's are dotted and all the T's are crossed. That's what I thought. Now tell my WWE Universal Champion to get out of that ring and pack his bags. I'm afraid Mr. Mazanin is correct. This rematch is cancelled. And the undisputed WWE Universal Champion is bound for SmackDown. Well, Miz gets his wish. The geography of WWE has just taken place in the middle. And what of has he got in store match. for us? Good luck countering that move in the draft, Regal. Miz just told the whole Raw audience, you want excitement? You come to SmackDown. While a huge question mark continues to hang over the Dark Horse champion. The undisputed WWE Universal Champion has arrived at SmackDown. Without Regal and Reigns, this guy would be working at the concession stand. That's more than an exaggeration, Corey. He put on a show at SummerSlam, and I, for one, think SmackDown got a steal in the draft. Yeah, we'll see. Miz, good to see you too, champ. Come on, what's with the boo-boo face when I'm the one who liberated you from his lordship? I didn't need liberating. So let's skip the pleasantries. You wanted the WWE Universal Champion on SmackDown. Here I am. What I wanted is the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. The champion can be anyone who understands what it means to represent the most must-see sports entertainment show on Earth. You think you're that guy? What I think is that I'm my own man, and the WWE Universe will come along with me or they won't. I'm not doing dog and pony shows for anyone. You might be your own man, but you are playing in my sandbox. And you can play big, bad, counterfeit, stone cold all you want. But you will quickly realize you're just making your life harder. I've never been one for the easy way. Good. That's the perfect attitude for your very first SmackDown main event. Since you were so ready to face Cody Rhodes on Raw, I can only assume you are ready for Kevin Owens tonight. I beat KO in the tournament, and I will gladly beat him again. Excellent. And just a heads up, I might come see your match in person. You know, just an impartial observer to get a closer look at the champion I drafted. <laughs> I'm sure he is. No other reason at all. See you out there. Oh, this is going to screw me over, isn't he? It's going to happen. This is wasting no time with his new acquisition. We have a WWE well, here we go. Championship match right here, right now on SmackDown. I'm smelling a title change here. KO's a hard man to beat. He's even harder to beat twice. Not that he needs it with the title at stake, but Owens will definitely have some extra motivation. It's hard enough having to fight Kevin Owens, but never mind having Miz in the background as well. Let's see if he can uh, overcome these odds. Fend off the attack. Pop up power bomb. Great strength being shown here. Onto the apron. Oh. KO is uh, not giving us an easy time yet. Right he wants that title. Oh my, what a splash! That was one big behemoth flying down with authority and force. And now thrown back into the ring. The referee continues. The count may call it soon. Oh, right to the throat. Great move. Owens up. The champion's down. The champion's down. Oh, my God. We're going to have a new champion. He kicks out with authority. Not even close. 
Fails to connect. So back into it now. Let's see what happens. Oh, here he comes. the dark horse. He's scouting his new champion. There's a difference. Oh my! Devastating impact to the back. He is looking to do some serious harm. KO getting rolled up here. And that will do it. Another flash win for the WWE Universal Well, champion. we've pinned him. We've got the one, two, three. Oh, God, he's got a chair. Interception by the champion. Talk about a backfire. And now KO's begging for mercy. Come on. This is unnecessary. Chair to the gut. This is an all-out assault. Our GM Miz was the one who introduced the chair in the first place. Maybe he thought the champ needed to take a seat after a tiresome match. We don't know. So how do you explain this? Miz looks like a kid caught with his hand in the cookie jar with that table. So much for I'll put him through the table. Put observer. him through the table. Run, Miz. Get out of there. Looks like the champion might take advantage of that table Miz set up. Another backfire for our GM. He better not go through with this. Here we go. And Bang. There the we go. Table. That's what we wanted. Is absolutely laid out. Miz tried to involve himself in this match and managed to hoist himself by his I do get the feeling, though, I might live the to regret this. The <laughs> Universal Champion has come to SmackDown, and he's making a statement to Miz, KO, in the entire WWE Universe. Yeah, well, take a look in the Miz's eyes, Cole. That champion's gonna regret this. What the hell, Miz? Impartial observer? You were passing chairs, setting up tables. I'm surprised you didn't chuck a ladder at me for good measure. Turns out the situation called for a partial observer. It's what's best for the image of the brand. And that would be Kevin Owens? What does he have that I don't? Kale's exciting, unpredictable. Yeah, he's a little rough around the edges, but Maurice has her stylist working on a makeover, and there's this amazing jacket being tailored. Look, the point is, KO has promised to be the Miz's undisputed WWE Universal Champion, and that's what matters. Believing a word KO tells you is your first mistake, and more importantly, I've beaten your poster boy twice now. Beaten him with a chair. Put him through a table. You mentioned a ladder earlier. Well, let's go there. At Clash at the Castle, you will put the WWE Universal title on the line against KO in a TLC match. Fine. I'm going to walk into that match with my title, and I'll walk out with it, too. No, no, no. You will not walk in with the WWE Universal title because it will be hanging high above the ring, right where it belongs. Out of your reach. Well, isn't that fantastic? We've got a TLC match to keep hold of our title, and we don't even get to walk in with the title into a pay-per-view. I can only see bad things approaching, but let's get this over and done with. Let's see if we can retain against KO. A lot's changed since the last time we spoke in an empty arena. Indeed. That night I gave you an opportunity, and you took full advantage. I guess. Most everyone in the WWE Universe thinks Roman Reigns won me the title and KO only beat himself to get me there. There will always be doubters. Every WWE Universal Champion will be in the shadow of Roman Reigns in one way or another. At least until someone can break the record with the title. Well, that's pretty much an impossible goal. Perhaps. My point is that you should take it a step at a time. You'll be the dark horse until one day you turn around and someone calls you the favorite. I think that might be a ways off. I'll just have to keep winning. A dominant victory over Owens tonight will go a long way towards answering that question in SmackDown's locker room, if not with its general manager. Miz can be a real tosser. <laughs> Quite right. But it seems to me that he has also given you an opportunity to prove he and the doubt was wrong. That's what being a champion is, huh? Constant battle to prove you deserve your spot at the top of the card. Indeed it is, my boy. Indeed it is.
WWE Universal Championship literally hangs in the balance. The fresh champion looks to prove himself again against Kevin Owens. Well, not just Kevin Owens. It's Kevin Owens plus tables, ladders, and chairs. I'm no mathematician, but that adds up to a bad night for the champ. Both of these men will leave with bruises tonight, but only one will be leaving with that championship. Oh, yeah. clothesline. Some frustration coming out of the champ right now. Gotta be taking a toll. Oh, here it comes. In oh, onto the chair. No other way to say it, guys. That looked like it hurt a lot. KO now. Making a move. Trucks me back into the ring. Oh, DDT. Springing off the ropes there. Now a German suplex to add to that. He's taking this to the floor now. Impressive oh! Of power. The Didn't get the full whack on the ladder, but every last drop of that'll power. still be a painful position to be in. Backbreaker. And a backbreaker like that will bring any competitor down to your size. Nice clothesline. And this has been a brutal war so far. Champ taking the worst end of the exchange. KO certainly able to scrap with the best of them. Case in point. And we go up now for the ladder. Got a hold of it. Yeah, let's see how long that lasts. And we don't have all of it. You and me both. The effects of this match are showing on the champ. Well, this has been one vicious TLC match. Those impacts and hits have to catch up with you at some point. Close line. So effective. Look at this, just stop after stop after stop. Not much fight left in KO, it seems. We're going to put the finisher on him, hopefully. Thanks for coming. End of now days. Now get that ladder. The title's going nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Good night. Look at this, Byron, getting that ladder position. Perfectly placed, if you ask me. Out the ring we go. Can we Here get we this championship now? I think this is it. Victory is within his grasp now. Just has to finish the job. Questionable timing of this move, Cole. Boom! Oh, so close. Got it. There we go. KO almost got up to us. He should have pushed us off the ladder, but we managed to retain a brutal war. But we hold on. TLC match at Clash of the Castle and my lord did we have to fight for that with KO and that's going to be it for today's episode folks, thanks very much for watching I'm sure our fearless leader Miz will let us know how he truly feels about that in the next episode, if you want to see another episode don't forget to drop a like don't forget to subscribe as well we're almost at a thousand subscribers now so any support would be greatly appreciated and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you soon.